Okay, we're ready to boot the mainframe. Except, of course, you don't boot a mainframe. You IPL it. That's IBM language. IPL, Initial Program Load. We're going to do it from tape. Here's the tape we're going to use. It's a standard 4 millimeter DAT. Uh, this one contains a program called ICKDSF, which is the Disk Initialization Program. We use this to, if you like, format or prepare the disks for an operating system to be installed. So we insert the tape. This is the big difference between this machine and a Multiprize 2000. This machine is an internal tape drive, right here. And you pop the tape in, and we're going to wait for that to load up. It'll only take a second or two. We're going to turn to the support element, or service element, or whatever it's called this week, um, to boot the machine. We we'll have to navigate to the appropriate task list. We want the CPC recovery, central processor complex. Then we go to groups. There's only one processor. And we select images because there can be multiple system images on this machine. Uh, it's like a virtual machine setup. There's only one image to find at the moment, and that's the image we're going to boot. So we go to load, and it's already filled out. We're going to go load address 0500, which is the tape, and we hit OK. Confirm the load. It's in progress. It's not going to take very long to start up a very small program for the tape drive. Completed. Now, here's the mainframe. This PC here is the support element, which is like the BIOS. It just starts and stops the mainframe and configures it. How do we talk to this program we've started? Well, you can't do that directly on a mainframe. The big blue cables are the channel cables. The channel cables go to a 3174, that box that had the little red flashing light for a second. That is a communications processor, a front end. And in order to talk to a terminal, it has to talk through this box, through the channel cables to the mainframe. Let's go to the terminal. It's in my study, which is full of junk. Here's the terminal, a classic. 3279 colour screen, switch it on. It's showing 505, which means no communications, so we do an attention. Return. There we go. Clear screen when ready. Turn. Here we go. ICK005E, message from ICKDSF. We're going to set this as the console. Oh, it wants uppercase, of course. Console. Find output device console. There we go. I see KDSF November 3rd, 2009, ready to go.